when we study science we hear a lot of famous names like albert einstein newton but what about all the women who contributed to science women have enormous contribution in science but not considered as they should be here is two strong women may we know them may we be them may we raise them so let's talk about the women scientist dr Kamal Randeve the cancer crusader Dr Kamal Randeve was an Indian medical researcher who is known for her research in cancer about the links between cancer and viruses Kamal was born on 8 November 1917 in Pune Maharashtra to Dinkar Dattatreya Samarth and Shantabai Dinkar Samarth Her father was a biologist who taught in Ferguson College of Pune Her father ensured that all his children were well educated. Kamal was a bright and intelligent student. Kamal did her schooling from the HHCP High School, Huzur Pagha, Pune. Her father wanted her to study medicine and marry a doctor. However, Kamal decided differently and started her education in botany and zoology as her main subject from Ferguson College. In year 1934, she received her Bachelor of Science degree and in 1943 she did her master degree from the Agriculture College Pune with cytogenetics as a particular subject. Kamal married mathematician Jay Singh Trimbakran Dewey on 13 May 1939. They had a son named Anil Jay Singh. Following her marriage to Jay Singh Trimbakran Dewey, Kamal Randeve moved to Bombay where her husband helped her with her postgraduate studies. She also worked at the Tata Memorial Hospital. This brought her in contact with V R Kanolkar a renowned pathologist who later founded the Indian Cancer Research Center she worked under his guidance for her doctoral degree from Bombay University and her mentor encouraged her to pursue a fellowship in in American University up in 1949 she got a post doctoral research fellowship to work on tissue culture techniques she worked with george otto gay who developed the hela cell line in his laboratory at john hopkins university in baltimore after kamal returned to india she rejoined the tata memorial hospital she rejoined icrc as a senior research officer Bombay and later she worked as head department of experimental biology and so on Kamal was favorite among her students who fondly addressed her as bai Thanks to her tireless efforts ICRC soon boasted of having the first tissue culture laboratory in the entire country Kamal also founded the experimental biology laboratory and integrated new research units in carcinogenesis cell biology and immunology Her work on leprosy bacteria led to the discovery of the necessary upgrade on leprosy vaccine in India In year 1945 she described the studies of cancer of the breast that drew special attention Kamal Randeve seeks to correlate the course of disease with heredity, child-bearing, histological structure, and other factors. In, in 1970, Kamal, along with the few fellow scientists, started thinking together about their social responsibility towards the less privileged women of the country. The latter could not seek a career in science due to several reasons. In year 1972, 12 founder members from different scientific institution came together with Dr. Kamal and established the Indian Women Scientists Association. This foundation aimed to promote the scientific ability among women scientists, understanding their problems and treating them in science and technology. The offices of IWSC former community health care center a day care center a nursery and a hostel for vanki movements This association perform various activities like science lectures workshop seminar and also provide scholarships In year 1989 Dr Kamal worked with a voluntary organization called Satyaniketan from 
Ahmedabad and collected data related to the nutritional condition of the tribal children. Dr. Kamal also worked on the nutrition and health of the tribal women and children with the help of government sponsored projects under the protection of an Indian Women Scientist Association. Dr. Kamal Randiwe won many awards, notably the Padma Bhushan in 1982 and the first Silver Jubilee Research Award in 1964. The award included a gold medal along with a cash prize. Dr. Kamal, Rin- Dr. Kamal Randiwe had also recognized in microbiology with the G.J. Watt Mull Foundation Prize in 1964 and so on. Dr. Kamal Randiwe Dr. Kamal Randiwe has more than 200 published research papers to her name with the support and encouragement of her husband as well as her parents. In a tribute, Dr. Rajini Bise recalls, Kamal was strongly believed that scientists who went abroad for postdoctoral work should return to India and develop new areas of research in their laboratories. A staunch nationalist, she instilled the same spirit in her colleagues enough that most of them returned to work in India, making Cancer Research Institute a renowned center for cancer research. Dr. Kamal Randiwe passed on 10 April 2001. With her generosity, integrity and obsession with advancement of excellence in science, Dr. Kamal Randiwe made an indelible impression on many minds. Her phenomenal academic and social contribution can never be forgotten. She believed she could, so she did. I express my sincere gratitude to Young Academy of India Mentex program for providing me this opportunity. I express my deepest thanks to my mentor Dr. Uttaradurai Rajan for her guidance and support. Your mentorship has helped me grow into my potential. Thank you ma'am for your encouragement and generosity. I would like to thank my teammates Radhika and Aditi for their support and valuable suggestions. It greatly helped me to finish my task. Thank you.